they were talking another language, I wasn't talking English and the first thing that came to my head is like, am I in Mexico? And I do not know why I actually thought Mexico for them. I, I don't know. I don't know. I just thought, am I in Mexico? And as we were flying past these buildings, I was thinking to myself, excuse me, I was thinking to myself, has there been an earthquake? Has there been a war? What's going on? At least 13 people have been killed after a tornado raged through a city on the US-Mexico border, destroying homes and flipping cars like matchsticks. Rescue workers in the city of Ciudad Acuna which is just across from Del Rio, Texas, have been digging through the rubble, as you can see there, of damaged homes to try and find victims. Local authorities have described the scene as being that of total devastation. But it didn't look like it was a conflict. It didn't look like it was a war that was going on at the time. Maybe it was, there was a certain situation, I don't know what, but it was basically a deserted place. The houses were, were abandoned. Uh, buildings were down. The damage left in a tornado's wake. The storm struck just after 6 in the morning. It was labeled a Category 4 storm with winds in excess of 300 kilometers per hour. Experts here at Mexico's National Meteorological Service tell us that tornadoes are extremely rare in Mexico. Civil protection officials went on to tell us that there isn't even a system of alarms in place and people weren't prepared for what hit them. I could see this whole view of a place where, I, all I can say is the buildings were deserted. The buildings were run down, broken, deserted type of buildings. Hundreds of homes are destroyed. The devastation is too much for some. A deadly tornado has brought this city and its people to its knees. And of those who survived, many were faced with the news that their homes had been destroyed. These survivors searched through debris, hoping to find some memento of normality, some useful tool to help them in the coming days. The tornado struck at just after 6 a.m. local time on Monday and devastated around 350 homes, knocking down walls and ceilings and taking anything in its path. I could hear the guys who were saying something like, um, what's it like, um, Christos, um, Christos something. And I, I have no idea what it is, but they were talking another language, I wasn't talking English. And the first thing that came to my head is like, am I in Mexico? And I do not know why I actually thought Mexico for them. I, I don't know. I don't know. I just thought, am I in Mexico? A tornado which ripped through the northern Mexico border city of Suedad Acuna has left at least 13 people dead. Another 180 were injured in the whirlwind which destroyed homes and wrecked cars. Most of those who died had been out in the open when the tornado struck. The search is still going on for victims. A country where they speak... I'm thinking that was... Spanish or Mexican? I don't know ocasionando daños considerables y hasta el momento tres personas sin vida, entre ellas desafortunadamente dos menores. Este tornado en la parte alta del sector poniente de la ciudad se registró. Es un tornado atípico que causó graves, muy graves daños en las colonias como el fraccionamiento Las Aves, pero la afectación mayor ocurrió en los actos de Santa Teresa. El gobernador ha visitado la escena, asesinando el daño. Es being called a national disaster. Adam Rainey, Al Jazeera, Mexico City.